Don't have no signal in here either. No signal in here either. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So today we are going to be installing our cell phone signal booster. And hopefully it works because I don't have reception anywhere. Out of the five rooms in my house, three of them, I don't have any reception. I have to rely on the Wi-Fi for it to work. So this is the whole setup, basically extra antenna, power cord, uh, mounting brackets, the antenna, a bunch of feet, and this thing. This is the actual unit that's going to go inside of the house. And that's why this window is open. You see this cable right here? This cable is the internet cable that runs to the garage to give that internet. And I'm just going to run the next one, the, in, the uh, cell phone signal booster cable through that. And then that way, and then we're going to run it straight up and onto the roof. So we are going to go on the roof. Let's get a ladder and start this project right. Make sure to smash that like and subscribe. So, uh, yeah, here we go. Wish me luck. Alrighty, so we are on top of the garage and I got this so we need to figure out how far up it can go so what we got to do is figure out how high up and far we can go which that actually looks like it right there Eh, kind of different being on top of the roof Kind of different being on the roof. Oh, that's not good. Don't need no big ass kink in it. All right. Let's see here. I got to figure this out. I need to bust out my cell phone and see what kind of signal I got on the roof and where the best place to put this is. So, let's see here. Okay, so I only have like three bars standing here. Let's see if I go up a little. Ooh, now I have no signals. I know it's kind of hard to see, but I don't have any signal standing right here. All right, well, so this is what I'm gonna do for the next few minutes. Take a couple steps every other foot or so and find out where the best cell phone signal is see right here i got two bars and i know that the closer that i get to the front of the house the more signal i get is how it usually ends to being like right there that gave me three bars so i'm just going to walk around the roof until i figure it out okay so i found the optimal spot now i need to get it and not exactly sure I know that this needs to be in the upright like that huh. okay um, let me figure it out and then I'll get back with y'all alrighty so I got it done uh, we used pressure treated wood because it is going to be out sores in the weather and you need pressure treated wood so that way the wood doesn't crumble on you in a few years um, the wood at the base though is not I just basically spray painted it and treated it uh, try to keep some of the rust and weathering away from it this right here was the ultimate spot guys I was only getting four bars right here three to four bars if I was to go where the drill is I would lose bars if I would to go that way I would lose them um, I wanted to optimally put it here but I found that that's a real 
that's a real dead spot right there so that wouldn't work so anyway let's uh let's go downstairs and do it from there oh wait a minute hold on i gotta do the cable i can't just have the cable just sitting up here freely i got uh i got a bunch of these that i'm going to use to secure it so i'll do that now done i want it a little loose but I also got it secured, so that will work. Now it just kind of goes this way. Here's a fun fact. Guaranteed meteorites in your gutter. If you were to take that and just gather it up and examine it, I guarantee you, you would find meteorite in there. Meteorite always lands on our roof in small little granules as such that's a fun fact neil degrasse tyson told me that one all right so let's gather all our stuff because i think we're done on the roof this is pretty secure this isn't going to go anywhere uh you know the wind blows it so be it all right let's go downstairs need to attach the other antenna now i would like to put this in one place but i realize that i am not going to be able to it because the power goes right there and the power cord is only about two feet long so that kind of limits my options of where i can stick this thing at so what i was thinking about doing is because i'm fixing to redo um, this I took down those acrylic shelves because I'm gonna put up a better shelf uh, but I was thinking about mounting it like that right there and then that way I can run power to it and everything so but before we do that though I want to show you guys the cell phone signal that I have in here right now before we turn this on all right so right now it says I'm at two bars wow that's amazing usually I don't I don't even get a bar in here, but right now it says we got two bars. Let's see what happens if I sat down over here. Okay, well, right here it's telling me that we have two bars in here right now before we hook up the cell phone booster. So we have two bars. Let's go ahead and hook it up and see what happens once we do that so we're at two bars right now oh we got oh wow I actually got a third bar it's because I stood up here let me set it down okay so yeah we have like two bars nothing all right so it's doing some kind of dance here it's saying okay there it goes all right so it looks like it's getting two to three bars which I can move the tower too because this will also tell me where I'm getting a better signal reception at so right now it looks like I'm only getting two bars where our tower is so it looks like we'll have to adjust that but unfortunately it is starting to rain right now so I will have to pick this up on another day let's see if I have any any signal in here let's see here I actually have, hold on, let's see here, sitting in my chair is usually where it's at, um, well, we're at two bars still, two bars, it's, I bet it, I won't get the, oh, there it goes, three bars, okay. So I probably won't get the accuracy that I'm looking for until I go back up on the roof and adjust the antenna appropriately. How about in here? Oh yeah, two, three. Okay, so there you have it. Cell phone signal booster. Um, I'll make another video on this when we pick it up, when I get into like maybe the fine tuning part of it. But I just wanted to basically show you guys the install, the unboxing of it, and just kind of make a video about it. So I hope you guys like it. Please smash the like. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. 
and thank you guys leave a comment we really need y'all y'all gotta pull through for me I have 800 subscribers but I noticed that I only have about 20 to 30 people if that actually participating in viewing the videos and I don't know how to get that up except for just keep making content and hope that the videos kick off so with that being said I'll see y'all in the next one. Y'all be cool.